The Avengers. Awesome movie. Awesome flick. What did you think of The Avengers? I haven't even watched it. I'll have money. See, this is... Why uh, are you here? Yeah. <laughs> I can leave. Can, can, can we no. fire her, like, in the next 12 minutes? <laughs> um, Everybody out yeah. there can yell at her for not seeing the movie. Oh, so, yes. Please yeah. do. I want to see your comments about no. her not seeing movies such as Captain America, The Avengers... And saying Thor was the stupidest movie in the world. <laughs> I still stand by that just to piss you off. You I'm over it. Right. <laughs> yeah. And uh. Captain America I haven't seen. I didn't know it was on Netflix. Go buy The Avengers. Definitely worth it. See The Avengers. They, that freaking... That, that movie was just so... <laughs> <laughs> I can't even explain it, guys. Awesome movie. Oh, so yeah. emotional. What did you not like about The Avengers? Anything? Actually, I did. Hawkeye is in this movie. He actually is in this movie, but he wasn't. I, I was. I really wanted to see him in, in his purple outfit, but with the mask and everything. But at this point, he's still a Shield member, and he's not, you know, Hawkeye. The what we the, know. In what we know is as Hawkeye. You know, that's what. I, but you know, that's just my own little opinion. I don't. I don't think they could have made the Avengers any better. No. I think it was just the greatest movie of the last few years. You know what my favorite part of that movie was? What? All right, well, you know when they're when they're on a ship and they're battling or whatever, and freaking Thor and Hulk are going at it or whatever. Okay? <laughs> yes. They fight and they just keep going at it. But later on, my part, my favorite part <laughs> is later on when they're fighting the machines or whatever. And they freaking take that one down. Yeah, they destroy the one and they're and standing. They stand there and Hulk just, <laughs> just cracks them. <laughs> I love that. I laugh so hard right there. And <laughs> Thor just flies across the room. Boom! <laughs> love that scene. No, you know what my favorite scene in the movie was? When Tony Stark and Loki are standing there. And Loki looks at Tony Stark and says, I have an army. And uh, and fucking Tony Stark just comes out and says, "We have a Hulk." Yeah, now, that was just that <laughs> line right there. There was so much sarcasm in that line. Like, this guy just messed this guy up. Yep. <laughs> Loki had nothing to say after that. He, was he, like, he didn't. <laughs> By the way, I still I, I love Loki. He's like he's a villain, but I love him. No, Loki is a good character. I love I love his character. The way this man portrayed him, the actor that portrayed him in both Thor and oh, yes. the Avengers. Yes. Perfect. They could have got anybody else. I but. wouldn't say he's a villain per se. He really just wants Odin's attention and he can't get it because He turned into a villain because because now he's he's after his brother Thor. You and know, he's now completely he, against and, Thor. And, and now that he Thor. understands that he's actually a well, what of it? Oh, um... Well, now that he understands that he's not from Asgard... Yeah. He's starting to see a little bit more about... Well, I'm not from this guy. I'm not from this universe. Why should I care? Right. Wasn't oh, his dad named Lothkin or something like that? I don't know. It touched on it on the, in the movie Thor. About who his dad was. His dad was... It wasn't his dad. It was the king of the... Of Asgard. Uh, no, no, no. The, it was the, oh, the I, ice people. Yeah, yeah, the ice people. That's his actual dad. No, it was the king. It wasn't his dad. Oh. Um, Alright, so that touches up on the Hulk, Iron Man... Thor, Captain America... Hawkeye, the Black Widow, and the Nick Fury, Fury. Nick Fury. Avengers. Yeah. Uh, all, uh, the Avengers. That touches up on all that. Um, what's co what's coming out that you're excited about, Ricky? Actually, they are making an Iron Man three. Oh my god! It's just coming I out. See that. They're they're <laughs> filming it, or they might have already done. I've already seen a little oh. trailer for it. I um, have to get. I will, I cannot wait. They're, uh, <laughs> They're uh, filming, or already done filming, I'm not sure, but I know that it's coming out, and next year is The Wolverine. Oh, shoot. Finally. <laughs> well, maybe they'll touch up on, you know, Captain America in this and that they did meet. 
Maybe. They could. They could. There's, now, like I said, there's so want... much about Wolverine's story, though, that they can do they, anything with this. They, 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 they can. can't really touch up on everything in the story. I, like, Wolverine has had samurai skills in his past. He's been in the military. He's Civil just, War. Civil War. He's been everywhere and everything, you know? Yeah. That's the, Wolverine's just all over the place. He's been everywhere. Um... So I'm excited for that. Yeah, I'm excited for both of those. Uh, the Dark World is also in production. Yeah, the Thor, Thor, the Dark World. That one's gonna be good too. I can't uh, wait for that one. I'm excited for this. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm semi excited for it. I, I want to see what direction they take it in. Yeah, they could go anywhere with it. So now, far, they've been on a run of just taking it to the next level and making it so much better. Is well, because now is that it, Loki's it, been banished. But is it? Are they going? Is it going to be like a, a prequel? Like, are they going to go back to before he becomes the king? Oh. When it, when he was running with uh with Loki and all his friends and everything like that. Well, or it could go past that. Well, you have to remember he wasn't king in Thor. And he didn't right, become yeah. king in Thor. Well, yeah. They did the ceremony, but then it was interrupted. Yeah. Right. That's right. So. It could be him leading up to him becoming king. Even though Loki's banished, doesn't he come back with his own army? Loki's just badass all around. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> with his scepter. Anyway, so, like, tell us your thoughts. Thor, Dark of the World, Iron Man 3, Wolverine. Also, is it? also in development. Stuff being talked about in development. Yes. Which would be what? Well, there's Captain America, Winter Soldier. Come on, guys. And the Amazing Spider-Man 2? Really? really? I'm really that? looking forward to that one. Are you? Well, how long are you going to keep making Spider-Man movies? Right. Well, Tobey well, Maguire destroyed it. Let it go. I didn't even see The Amazing Spider-Man 1 because well, I was so tired of Spider-Man, the other movies. He's so whoa, depressed. Whoa, 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 guys. The Amazing Spider-Man takes gets rid of him completely and takes it in a whole new direction. It's supposed to be one of the most... It's the best Spider-Man ever that they've come out with. I have someone who's followed every single comic book and saw the first three original, so they sucked. He saw The Amazing Spider-Man. They sucked. They were horrible movies. They he were. saw The Amazing Spider-Man and he was like, it is the best they've come out with. Alright, give us your feedback on that and what tell do you, us... What do you guys think yeah. about The Amazing Spider-Man? Um, what's the other one coming out? What is it? X-Men Days... What is it? Days of Future Future's Past. Supposedly that's what, what it's called. This is what I found out. I don't know if they're going to change the name, if that's going to stick or whatever. But these are things that they're talking about in development. What's it going to be about? I haven't heard anything. No about. idea. No idea. They're, they're I mean, just... haven't they already touched on everything? No, 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 no. no. X Men. X Men is, is wide. Wretches. Yeah, it's wide. <laughs> it's so way much. Wide. Like they haven't even touched up on Kitty. They, they did a little bit about Kitty, but they yeah. haven't even touched up on her. She's my favorite X Men. Is she? She's yeah. got one of the best. Kitty and talents. Rose. I like Storm. Storm's the shit too. I love Storm. Well, if you want to get into my best, my my favorite X Men, that would be Wolverine. Uh, <laughs> I, you know what I want to see? I want to see, like you know they did they did uh, X Men Origins Wolverine. I want to see Gambit. Oh, definitely. I want to see a Gambit, a, a, an Origins Gambit. That's what I want to see. Ah, uh, so, and also coming out is Guardians of the Galaxy. We're not gonna really touch up about that because nothing's really been mentioned yeah, about it. We don't know much about it. So, just throwing it out there, Galaxy or. Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, your favorite villain. My favorite villain? And your favorite hero, then your favorite villain. Of all time? Yes. Crap. Actually, I'm, I'm an Iron Man person. Is As far as, you know, superheroes go. That's that's my man. Does it have to be this kind of superhero and supervillain, or could it just be any superhero and supervillain? Well, let's do it. Okay. So your favorite villain, his favorite hero? My favorite hero is Iron Man. You know, Tony Stark, Iron Man is just, he's just a normal average guy, you know, and he created something special, you know. 
villain. I don't know. I think I've got a newfound, newfound liking of Loki. Actually, I really do. A newfound liking of Loki. Favorite hero, favorite villain. Well, I'm thinking of my favorite hero right now. My favorite villain is Harley Quinn by far. She's the best super villain out there. I don't care what anyone says. My favorite superhero. It's gotta be Jean. Jean Grey? Yeah. Jean Grey's awesome. That's all we have for you. What Gary? about yours? Yeah, what about oh, you? Look <laughs> at that. We are out of time. <laughs> ah, let's see. Favorite hero. There's so many to choose from. But there's a one that I have in mind. My favorite hero would have to be, and by far has always been, Batman. Batman, yeah. That's, and my favorite villain, <laughs> if you want to go into that, <laughs> um, the most sadistic one of them all, Galactus. Galactus, yes. <laughs> Gal and I don't care what anybody says, he's sadistic. He's horrible. Speaking of Galactus, just sit throwing this out there. Go watch the adventures. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and that is all the time we have for you guys today. Oh, before we leave, I wanted to touch up on a few things. Uh, comments. You guys post your, post your comments down below, and we will read them next week during the show. Um, some comments that we got today are, are some comments that we got from la the last show we did, which was two weeks ago. We apologize for not being here last week. Yeah, we had technical difficulties. Mm -hmm. And I had actually had to upload a video via my laptop to let you guys know that something was going down. But um, we got, we asked, what was the question? What was your favorite horror movie, correct? Yes. Right, yes. Uh, we, got we got stuff like Jurassic Park. Like, that was one of the comments. What was one of the comments you seen? Oh, uh, Killer Clowns from Outer Space. Killer Clowns from Outer Space. That's a great Space. movie. That was and, my favorite comic. And somebody said all the classics, which, yes, of course, all the classics. So, your guys' favorite Marvel movies. So, tell us what they are. What, what, like, yeah, uh, give us your feedback on all the movies that you've seen in Marvel, and you can talk about all of them, all the characters. You want to talk about some of the characters? Let us know what you want us to talk about. Yeah. Sounds good. Don't want to say anything? No. She says bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs> Have a great day.